Good morning guys, welcome to today's video. Every morning I wake up and get so excited to see what is gonna happen today that I jump out of bed and get ready and come downstairs because I'm excited. But today, I laid in there for as long as humanly possible because today is show prep day, my least favorite day of life. Do you guys like show prep day? Kind of. You do? I get It's kind of exciting because it's something to do. It's amazing. It's cute when they're all wet. You like because they're cute when they're all wet? Spoken like a mom. Oh, shut up. Um, um. All right, Sophie has something she's been waiting to tell you. Go check it out. Daisy's. Um, Daisy the blue eyed. Donations. On, on Instagram. Instagram. She has a new Instagram yeah, page. I to make her TikTok. Yeah. So today we have so much to do. All the things we should have done yesterday that we didn't have time to do because we had to go to the barn, we had to ride, then we had to go to the other barn, then we had to ride, then we had plans with friends at night. Like, yeah, we're behind. We're super behind. Never too far behind to play with puppies though. Can you guys believe how big she is? Like she grew so much. All the struggle finding her a puppy food and she like already grew. She grew. Like she's so much bigger now. She is She's also nine weeks old. Nine weeks old. It was dark and dreary and gross outside. Yeah, just perfect for a horse show. Um, it's supposed to not be bad tomorrow, but it's supposed it to be right cold. Horse, have a personal yeah, like it's gonna be cold, it's gonna be muddy, it's gonna be miserable, but we're gonna go and we're gonna be there and we're gonna just do our best. It's gonna be fun, it's gonna be fun. Anyway, if any of you guys are searching for dog food for your dogs, then um, I wanna share with you that we recently put our puppy on this. And I it's love this photo. it's like raw food, but it's human grade. Like you can actually eat this stuff. I showed it in a, another video. It is a powder. It's just like a powder, but inside here are dehydrated pieces of food. So it's got chicken and beans and sweet potatoes, everything that she can have. And it's supposed to be good for puppies, but I bought the wrong one. Apparently only the beef one is good for puppies. But anyway, I want to show you what it looks like. So this is what it looks like after you add water. This one thickened up a lot because we ended up making too much, so we put it in the fridge. Before we give this to her, we will add a bunch of warm water and make it like a really soupy consistency because that's the way she likes it. Because she's a Dalmatian, she really needs a lot of water, so we add a lot of water and make it like a soup, like a really runny stew. It's got little pieces of chicken in here and vegetables and all sorts of yummy stuff. So crazy that the powder turned into like stew though. So at first she hated it. All of our dogs hated it. We even gave it to Molly. Molly doesn't seem like she loves it that much, but I want her to have something healthy too. I want them all to, but none of our dogs would eat it at first. None of them. But Daisy's like come to really enjoy it. So this morning she ate two bowls because she we're just still figuring out what she needs. Yeah, so get, Sophie gave her breakfast this morning and she ate it. This and is, then you know when he's all wet, he just stands there. Yeah. He's pretty cute. He's like depressed, like, I hate my life. Mom, look. So we went to uh, the barn last night and Gabby and Kaylee were posing for pictures in their matching sweaters. Oh, and little, here's all the photos just and playing. Called them twins. A little girl called them twins. Just one is one is smaller and one is taller. That's what she said. But she had live My focus first. on, live photo on, so you can see like the few minutes before the photo. But yeah, that's the twins in their new sweaters and their jeans. Okay, back to the Okay. So uh, Sophie came downstairs and took her up for her pee and fed her breakfast. But sometimes I find that she doesn't eat enough in the morning. And then like a couple hours later, she needs like a better breakfast, a bigger back breakfast. And we're trying to still make sure that she eats enough. So um, she had one little bit and then she had a bigger breakfast and she licked the whole entire bowl clean. We ended up having to add an egg. We're going to add an egg until we're finished this package because this package doesn't quite have enough protein for the puppies. So we're adding an egg every other day. And she licked the whole entire bowl clean. Like she would not stop licking the bowl. And she was starving. Like went to Molly and said, I want your food. And so we gave her a little bit more and she licked that whole bowl clean. Like she actually is getting to really like it now. Sit still, I wanna take pictures of you. Sit. Good girl. Sit. Sit. Sit back here. Oh, oops, sorry, sorry. Sit, like back here. She she does that thing where she like folds her body up. Sit, stay. Oh my goodness! You want kisses? You want kisses? You want to kiss the people? She's like, yeah, I want to kiss the people. 
you're such a cute puppy. Yes, you are. And Molly is cute too. So if you ask me today, what team are you on? I'm on team all of our dogs. I love them all. Not one of our puppies is better than the other. All right, so do you guys remember when Ruby used to just run free down in the barn, even as a tiny puppy? And we don't go in the puddle. Do not go in the puddle. Wait, if he drinks it, that's going to be talented. She's a, she's a prissy puppy. Anyways, there is none of that for this puppy. She's like, I don't like getting wet. I'm going home. She ran down to the barn. Did she run down here? Yeah. Oh, I let her run. As soon as I picked up the leash. She seems too she little. ran away. She seems too little to get used to the fence. But look at, remember Molly used to have to go under the fence right away? And she's so tiny. Daisy just went and See, she woke up, you guys. We changed no, the food. The cats have a routine. They know that I come down at eight. The cats? But, yeah, and my cat always meets me now. Aw. It is. Uh, it's uh, almost 70 degrees. And I'm pouring sweat. Beautiful. First and fourth and fifth. Um, Storm has the first, second, first, and champion. Why do you want to paint the All right. I feel like you can shoot. I got the USA colors. Yeah, you did get the USA colors. I mean, that's a sign. Anyway, we're down at the barn because we're getting ready to go to the other barn. I miss this little barn. Do you feel like we're never here anymore? Yeah, me too. Oh my gosh, Crazy! What the heck? I just brushed her. Okay, oh. so this is her favorite spot. <laughs> yeah, she's a, she's a fire dog. She likes to sit up high. She likes to climb ladders. She doesn't like being held. No, not when she's down here. Uh-oh. You're fluffy. Fluffy girl, fluffy dirty girl. You cleaned the arena, Gabby, at chores time? Did you fill the water bucket? I took my bucket to the barn, to the other barn, so I would always have something that I can, uh, so that I could groom the horses with, and yeah, I decided to bring it back. So the trouble is, is that we're leaving to go to the barn, right, in a minute. And we're gonna probably get there around three and we're not gonna get home till nine. That's how, like we have lessons. So that's depressing, that's depressing because once we get home at nine, we still have to get ready to go to the show in the morning and I still have to edit the vlog. So depressing, that's what it is. Don't let her wreck, wreck that one. Whoa. She's like a squirrel catcher. See, does any is anybody surprised that Gabby's teaching her dog to kill? Oh, Gabby! Gabby, that was so expensive. Oh, she could rip it. She couldn't rip it. I think the peg fell out maybe then. Dog, you're buying me a new one. That's the second thing she killed. Let me see it, Sophie. Oh my goodness, Molly. Molly. Molly's a killer. Is it actually popped? It was in a hard cover though. So it was hard to pop it because she didn't rip the cover. No, it's your dog. Are you trying to say that I didn't think she'd kill it even though she was really giving it? Yeah. That's right. We At least we know she popped it and didn't bite it. Bring it in here. I don't want the... Let her go. Let her go. Just let her go. I watch you as you dry. You have to still let her run, Sophie, even if she picks up poop. But you still have to let her run. She has to build muscle. She has to build muscle. Do you still let her run and play? Look at her, she wants down, let her go. To go eat poo poo. <laughs> I mean, sometimes babies eat poop, let her go. She has to explore. Sophie's an overprotective mother. I don't know where she gets it from. Sophie. She is walking poo poo. Yeah, you'll be end up giving her a bath. Let her go. And then his are Orange. His eyes are orange. They're brown. They just look orange. Look at how pretty he looks. He's fat. 
He's not that fat. My cat's a beautiful goddess. Kitten. She takes after you. Yeah. No. Oh, I think she's right there. It was like this perfect little Munchkin. puppy. <laughs> and this puppy's perfect too, but you have to lock her in. Protect her. Like you can't. Mommy, you should... It's okay. She can eat poop. She, she would stop puppy. and come, I know. But Sophie won't even let her puppy eat poop. Poor puppy. <laughs> She's like, I know where the poop is. Where the mice is. Where the, the mice, mice are. Go eat the mouse, puppy. All right, let's get our Molly, stuff ready. Molly, Molly, Sophie, them. leave her alone. Oh, look, there's another one. Just let her run. Molly loves to go in here because. I promise she'll be fine. Do you know I'm looking and I can't help but smile? Do you know how much I love you? Molly looks in here everywhere for the light. Oh, so every time Gabby comes in here, she plays with this, this light. Do you guys see it? It's like a laser light. And she passes on it. Wait, she passes on it. She, she tries to kill, kill it. it. First, she tries to chase it. It's really good for wearing down her nails. But when she came in, she sat there and waited for Gabby to get it out. Now she looks for it. You put my favorite song on. I put my feet up. Just sing along and I can't help but feeling just loving this moment. Can we stay here forever? I'm loving this moment. Can we stay here together? Right, it's just a smorgasbord of fun at this barn, you guys. If you don't want to play with the Dalmatian, play with the Border Collie. If you don't want to play with the Border Collie, play with the Golden Doodle. If you don't want to play with the Golden Doodle, play with the ponies or the cats. Ew. Could not catch me. Oh. What a difference. If I could stop the time, don't you know that I would? Cause I'm just loving. This moment, can we stay here <laughs> forever? <laughs> He's hungry for poop. I told you Sophie's I'm gonna get thin. Together. If I could stop the time, don't you know that I would? Cause I'm just loving this moment. Can we stay here forever? These are the good ones. <laughs> These are the good dogs that listen. The dog does not listen. Molly listened from two years younger than that. I know, Molly listened from day one. How dare you! <laughs> you let her find out what she loves in life. All right, we are ready to go. I am like so dreading this. So we have these things, these charcoal things. What we find them the most useful for, I hate them because they just fall apart. What they're the most useful for is getting bot fly eggs off. Chino's got a bunch. So we got to use those on our horse's legs. Um, we got our braiding kit. We got uh, our cleaning kit. We have all of our solutions that we need. I have my grooming glove. I have my yarn. Storm. I actually love that Kaylee's horses are here because our horses recognize them as friends and if Finn and Oakley are together. Storm and Chino are way down there, I showed you guys. Finn be hanging out with Oakley. Like how crazy is that that he made a new friend that fast? Like I don't think that Finn ever met Oakley. Oakley's like, I will go first. I'm the king of the horses. Chino's turning into a beefcake. 
Oh, where is Tex? I better go look for him. That's odd that he'd be alone. We actually did find Tex. He's over in our horse's normal stomping ground. See him over there? He's probably looking at the girl. Or he's looking at the fact that there's a twin in that field. See, there's Tex. And there's his twin. Tex. Twin. Storm has this new mark on him. Gabby says it's just like the hair switching over, like the light brown going into the dark. Doesn't it look like crossbones? <laughs> like some kind of creepy crossbones? A skull and then the crossbones. See the cross? I know I'm picking scabs too. It's kind of kind of enjoyable. Yeah. Unless your horse doesn't like it. Swishes you <laughs> your hair doesn't you like it. Tail. Let's see if I can show you. Like, I can't actually see the bot flies. Can you guys see? That looks like mud. But there are bot flies everywhere on him, and you just basically go like this, and this attaches to the bot flies and just pulls them right off. The goal tonight is to not bath them because it's freezing cold. Like, who wants to be pro bathed and freezing cold? So we got some Miracle Groom in a bottle. We're gonna use that. We're gonna use like a, a cloth, a sponge, and warmish water and spot clean them. Can you hear me, Chino? He's like, yeah, do that. Spot clean me. So we're gonna try that and just to get them clean because this show was posted online and said that they're actually gonna be taking a lot of notice on how people are dressed and stuff like how you turn up like how you know you dress and stuff you can win a prize for it and so i mean if they're going to be looking we want to make sure our horses look clean what's wrong with his mane it's so pretty does it feel funny still it's been raining for days and it still feels like it has the stuff in it that i put I in it crap load of stuff in it like braiding stuff yeah. Oh, you did it. That's right. That's why, because Chino's doesn't feel like that, and I did his. All right, Sophie, how's it going there with your braiding? Good. Oh, look at that. I, look at that, Ben. You I got like a nice to braid. start from the back. Okay, you start from the back, and now you're doing it the right way, starting from the front. Yeah, but I don't want to start from the front. Good boy, Finn, for Are standing so nice. Finn? Standing so nice for Sophie. Before, he hated when people were above his head. Yeah. Now he doesn't care. Now he doesn't care. Right. I hate riding. Gabby's ready to go riding. I'm gonna go out there in a sack. Hey Chino. Laura's already on her fifth braid, sixth braid. Two, four, six, seven. Seven, only 20 more to go. There should be a limit. There should be a limit of things that you should be asked to do for your children. You should never be asked to murder for your children, lie for your children, steal for your children, or braid your horse, their horse's mane. Like, this is torturous, you guys. At yeah. least this time I have this nice little bucket to stand on. Seven, and you have 13 more to go, 14 more to go. Gino, we should just cut that hair right off. Yeah, cut it. Just saying. Some new sand in the arena. Looks like nice and soft. When I dance around, I can't help but feeling just loving. Don't you know that I would
you drive Do you know I'm looking? I got 27 braids in Chino's hair. This is a family affair, you guys. It takes all of us. 27 braids in Chino's hair, Gabby's buttoning, Sophie's on her last two braids, and I'm about to start Storm, who just had a ride. Right? All right, so Brandon's here. Oh, I thought I saw ice. Anyway, Brandon's here, skin dark, and Sophie's doing a derby tomorrow, which means that she's gonna have Phil underneath the jump, and she's nervous. So I said, I whoa, would come and get some bricks. I mean, not bricks. I'll come and get some sticks and some stuff, branches, some twigs. I need some branches, like like green stuff. You guys see any green stuff? Oh man, this is a job too much for Laura. All right, I got some green stuff and some branches. I've learned so much this year. Honestly, like, I'm building jumps, I painted jumps. I'm like learning all the stuff, you guys. Like, I wanna be, I can set up jumps, like the trainers say, make that a cross rail, put that at two feet. Okay, they don't say that. They say, put that on the cups. And I can do it all now, like, before I'd be like, wait, what? But yeah, I'm getting better and better every year. Oh, okay, let's go build Sophie some jumps. All right, so there's my jump. I'm assuming Brandon will fix it up a bit. Sophie's already going around, getting ready. And he went around, he was like, whoa, what's that green stuff? Super fun, crazy lesson. How'd you like it, Kaylee? So much fun. Yeah. Yeah. Once I can actually see my striding from the corner when we turn. Oh, good. So then, but do you? But tomorrow your... I won't be able to. Yes, you will. You're gonna do great. You're gonna beat no, Brandon. No, it's just the way that Chino was thinking. It was like our minds were like, That's I'm what... gonna take a long. I'm gonna add. Good. Yeah. All right, we are getting our horses into their beds for the night with their nice <laughs> show jammies on. Storm's got some. Storm's got the blue one on. I don't know why Chino gets this one. Why does Chino get this one? I think Finn should have this one. Oh, no, it doesn't fit. Oh, it doesn't fit me. Don't you know that you're beautiful?